Hi guys, once again I've forgotten to bring you through right at the beginning but here we are at another little Renault slip that I'm doing this time with my son. It's a cheap little 90 odd square metre house um, near the hills and you can see it was built probably late 60s early 70s so unfortunately it's got a concrete slab, often those houses would have jar of floors but it's got roller shutters on the front window, beautiful big front window there. Just um, trying to call the fireplace guy to see uh, whether we can reinstate this fireplace. We've got an old, there was an old evap pretty unit on the roof, we've already had that replaced so we're either going to clean up those grills or replace them, haven't quite decided. Uh, we've stripped some wallpaper off here today. So this room will eventually be nicely painted and it will have some vinyl planks on the floor. Coming through here, we've got a kitchen. I've had the kitchen designer here today to design up the cabinetry. So we've ripped out a blue kitchen in here, very filthy. Uh, so glad it's gone and glad I can clear, see a clear space now. Nice glass door going out to the outdoor area. Coming down here, we've got a nice passage, high ceilings. We've had some down lights put in, which makes it look really nice. We'll have the um, vinyl planks here and then basically white walls. Decided to just keep this stuff on here rather than try and rip it off and then have to deal with the patching, etc. Uh, from the walls that probably get damaged. So this will all be just white and blend in nicely. Going to keep this beigey coloured floor tile in the laundry. Going to clean up this uh, unit here. Not sure whether this door can be refurbished or not, so I'm just waiting for someone to come and have a look at that. We're just going to paint, obviously the walls will be white and clean everything up in here. And having white tiles to start with is a big bonus because they're pretty easy to just um, clean up and make look good. Nice bedroom in here. There's no built-in robes um, back when these were built, but what's good about it is a nice window, which when I bring you through next time, you'll be able to see the garden out the front, which will start to look nice. Doesn't look great yet. Uh, roller shutters, which is good. Nice about pretty cooling. The bathroom, we'll just keep all the white tiles. Oops. Trip over. Um, I've got the grout guys coming in to redo all the grout and clean it up a bit fix up this shower floor, we'll put in some new taps, but basically it's a pretty good bathroom. We'll put in a new vanity here, new taps, um, had a new downlight put in already, an exhaust fan, ah, that's why that's there, I'd say, don't want to lose that. Um, coming through to the master bedroom. Nice colours, we've stripped some more wallpaper off in here today. My painters have started patching. We're going to get rid of this old uh, split system in the wall. It doesn't work, so we need to patch that up. We've got new down light. We'll put in, or we'll clean up the grills. Nice cool, about pretty cooling. Nice big window and roller shutters. Um, and it quite, what's quite good about this is that there's a built-in robe, or you know, they've built it in and it's got good sliding doors and the frames are white which is a bonus we need to replace this door but all the other doors will just be painted so a nice cheapish reno this bedroom needs a bit of dealing with i had a laborer come in and he told me he knows how to patch and he's made a massive mess here which the painters now are having to try and deal with cursing him a little bit not really sure what all the black paint is on the walls and the door but anyway we'll just clean up these doors I need to get this off hmm yep but otherwise i think this door will clean up okay need to deal with next doors also it's a bit of a dump next door and it's an empty house so I'm also trying to contact the owner of that one and see what we can do about that. But all in all, I'm quite excited about this nice little cute cheapie. Just looking at the back. 
My paint is of um, high pressure plans of brick pavers, which is really nice. We've got a nice big undercover area here. So um, even though it's a small house, got a beautiful big outdoor living area and a really nice big shed down there, which is a big bonus in these budget suburbs. People usually have tradie trailers, um, camp trailers, that kind of thing. So um, that will be really a selling point. Had the fences painted already. So we're making nice progress already. Started painting the render. Uh, you can see the original colour where the downpipes are. So it's a nice, fresher, still beige kind of tone, just to tie in. I painted the patio as well. So I'll keep you posted and I'll try and send some more regular updates now that I've started. Until next time, see you.